is, of course, more than one universe. In one such world, in the corner of a backwater galaxy, humans rule over a senseless planet. However, that's about as important as a speck of dust in this pluralistic cosmos. Well, here in the netherworld, things work the same way. I wanted to tell him that, but he had problems with my prophecy already. That precious little puppet is Lord Zeta, an overlord with the most powerful mana in the universe. <laughs> Nothing can stop me now. Security's tighter than I expected. Then again, this is where the sacred tomb is kept. Oh, I shouldn't be wasting my time. If I don't hurry up, my netherworld will disappear like that damn prophecy said. orders I am here to destroy you so uh, let me guess you are the reason my netherworld is supposed to be destroyed <laughs> I'm a freaking overlord you idiot the strongest one in the entire cosmos are you really the best warrior that prophecy could send? I'll crush you like a grape!
Raiden, hmm? I've seen that fighting style somewhere before. But I'm over it. Looks like my netherworld is safe now. <laughs> I'm one badass freaking overlord! It's about damn time. Everything pertaining to my netherworld should be recorded in this book. Let's take a look, see if things have improved since I trashed that Raiden guy. Doom the netherworld? Really? How dare you read to me like that? I'm a freaking overlord! What is this? Sacred tome? Ha! <laughs> More like sucky, dumb thing. my prophecy came true. Lord Zeta avoided destruction by trapping his soul in the sacred tome. Man, that guy's harder to kill than a cockroach. Anyway, thusly Lord Zeta's netherworld vanished into inky black nothingness. Oh, looks like an SOS from Zeta. Guess he needs my help again. <laughs> Holy crap. I lost everything. My netherworld, my castle, my brothers, even my own body. It's all gone! How did I end up like this? I was the most badass overlord in the universe for Magog's sake. Hey, hold on a second. Who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Only beings of demon class or higher are allowed in my space. How'd a little girl get in? Oh, you're not concerned with me, sir. I'm not? That's a relief. Have a nice day. Hey, hey wait. Cease! Halt! Come back! What the hell was that about? Ah 
Aha! A strong mana is coming this way. I can feel it! Who could it be? It better not be Salome. summoned me here. Oh, right. So, you're looking literary today. Walk me through your makeover, page by page. <laughs> Stop laughing! I didn't do this on purpose! Nobody knows when Pram the Oracle came to my netherworld. But she recently received one of her own. She's young, but she has the ability to see into the future, which earned her respect among the other overlords. Still, her exceptional mana power is also making them nervous. Pram is the oracle who foretold my netherworld's demise. How will this affect business? Can I pull out of this? along. in trouble I rushed right over oh please cut the crap Mickey you're here to kill Zeta what goodness no worried about Lord Seta. This thing, uh, these things, are Dark Lord Valtvoga, the Star Overlord. In many worlds, they're the final boss. The lower body is a dragon named Dryzen. The face on its stomach is Ophelia, the fallen angel. The upper body is Mickey, who supposedly makes the decisions. But the other two tend to bully him. They're basically calling the shots. For a demon general, he's pretty spineless. There's more than one world in the universe, so of course, there are many nether worlds. I have mine, but it's not the only one. Of course, with all these nether worlds floating around, Overlords try to conquer other nearby netherworlds. In fact, they pounce on any chance to do so. Nobody attacked me before because of my mana power, but now... Wow, Zeta, even though you're just a little novella now, you haven't lost any power at all. Damn right! I'm the best there is! You lame overlords can't compare to me! Put a sock in it already. Mana power isn't worth much if you can't even move around. You're awfully helpless for a badass freaking overlord. Damn. Seriously, what's the plan? Can I really get my netherworld back again? Don't forget, I'm Pram the Oracle! You 
became the sacred tome, right? Well, just write your wish in the book. The Netherworld will return. Are you sure? Just trust me on this, okay? <laughs> Though you obviously can't write it yourself. Damn it! Arms! Maybe you can write some in. Nah, arms are overrated. Ooh, here, I'll try writing something. Let's see. Whoa, time out! Stop! It's my body, and I'll decide what gets written on it. Write something about a castle. I need an overlord's castle. Castle? Hmm. Isn't that a little greedy? Hey, I know! How about this? Sweet! An overlord's castle! What the hell? It's a doghouse! Why not start again from the bottom? Life's not easy, you know. You could have made it easier!
<laughs> That's harder than it looks, so <laughs> it took some of my power as soon as I wrote down my wish. I see. Each wish has a price. I assume it depends on the size of your wish. Something huge like rebuilding a netherworld would probably erase a basic demon. Which means only an overlord could create a netherworld. How will you compensate us for the trouble we've gone through to help? <laughs> Money! Babes! Alcohol! <laughs> Can't you just calm down? Lord Zed is in trouble and we need to help him, okay? Okay, Zeta, you can go to the new netherworld now. Yeah, thanks. You're not a bad guy, Mickey, but that's why you'll never be a great overlord.
I'm ready. Here. So that's your little trick? Hmm, I guess this might prove amusing at best. Where there is good, there is also bad, correct? It's important to have balance. Oh, no! How could you, Ophelia? Now Zeta will be angry. How dare you do this to me? So let him be angry, jeez. You're the Dark Lord, aren't you? Grow a pair. You're practically shaking at the thought of Lord Zeta. Shut up! You're a newbie overlord anyway. <laughs> Is that all you've got? I'm supposed to submit to you just because you're older? Mana power is all that matters. I can show you if you want. All right, Pam, forget it. You're more powerful than I am. <laughs> Glad to hear it. <laughs>
ready. Here.
I'm ready. Here. Ready. Like it?
Great work, everyone. To be honest, I was worried. Power or not, I can't fight in this form. But that's all worked out now. I'll just have you fight my battles for me. <laughs> hmm. Even in that pathetic state, he still acts like an overlord. I knew I could count on him. But there isn't time to relax. I can no longer read the Netherworld's future. <laughs> Seven netherworlds until I get my own back. Stay the hell away from my netherworld, Mickey. Got it? But, but, but I didn't do it. Um, excuse me, Zeta? Even though it was all Mickey's fault this time, aren't Netherworld supposed to be full of monsters? You can't have a Netherworld without monsters, can you? It's kind of a universal truth, don't you think? Hmm, I see your point. I actually had to kill a lot of monsters in order to get my first Netherworld. See? Exactly! So it makes sense for roving monsters and wild demons to be in the netherworld. Oh, um, by the way, Zeta, another assistant should be on the way. Who is it this time? It better not be Salome. No, that had never happened. She left of her own free will. Salome wouldn't dare show her face again. Here he is! It's about time. You're... Long time no see, <laughs> young Zeta. My eyesight isn't what it used to be. So I ran into a few planets on the way here. I'm assuming they were destroyed. I, I, I must apologize. It's an honor, Dragon Overlord Babylon. I thought you were retired. Nonsense! I'm in my prime! Young ones like you are no match for my experience. That huge geezer is Dragon Overlord Babylon. He's the oldest known overlord, and he once ruled the universe with his incredible power. He was unbeatable back then, but they say the brain is the first thing to go. body back, don't you? My body? Yeah. If we keep recording wishes and the netherworld returns to normal, your body will too. Y you're serious? I am an oracle, aren't I? Just leave it to Pram, okay? <laughs> uh, okay. I suppose that's all settled. So, why was I summoned? I'd like you to record your wishes for a new netherworld on Zeta here. Ah, I see. But I don't want any questions about how I can write without hands. None of your damn business. <laughs> <laughs> 